It's a four-week class where we meet uh, for two hours, four times, um, and then in the middle of that we take off for four days, typically over the President's Day holiday, and uh, drive down to Baja. Um, it's one day on the bus, two days on the water, and, and coming back, um, where we go out on the boat and interact with whales. It really was indescribable. I'd, I've never heard of any sort of trip like this for marine biology with any sort of university or community college or anything at all. Um, so this was really an extremely amazing opportunity that we had um, and it was a big first for OCC especially for a marine science class. They have tons of study abroad classes for other courses but nothing has ever been done like this at least at OCC for marine science so I think this is definitely going to open a really big door for students like us who want to experience things in the world that we would not have the chance to do um, without OCC. They really emphasize the field experience, which is what we all love and what we, what we want to do. So a trip like this just makes us, it kind of solidifies that this is what we want to do with our career. What the students take away from it is not just the field intensive um, part of the class and the, and the class itself where they learn about gray whales specifically, but it gives them an appreciation, an appreciation for science. And many of them become hooked on science at that point. And they may not go on to study marine mammals or fish directly, but they might study something about the environment. I learned to just appreciate our world's oceans even more. I mean, it was the largest mammal I've come across. I think every single one of us cried on the boat at some point, whether it was just seeing the whale for the first time so close or touching it, but it was, it was an emotional day, but it was absolutely indescribable. I am um, obviously a poor student. I'm actually only working part-time while going to school full-time. And just before the deposits and everything were happening for this trip, um, our car broke down. And so all of our funds had to go into fixing our car. So we were kind of, we are a little desolate at the moment. And so I was like, well, the gray whale trip's just not gonna happen for me. Karen informed me about the scholarship because I wasn't aware of it. And so I went out um, and I wrote my essay and I got it turned into her. And then Karen called me um, about a couple days later to let me know that I'd actually received the scholarship and oh, man, I, I was at work when I got the call and right afterwards I went out and I was telling my coworkers, I just want a scholarship, I get to go pet whales in Mexico. It definitely like solidified that this is, this is what I want to be doing for the rest of my life. After this, I definitely want to get back into um, more marine science classes at OCC, then get my um, Associates of Science degree from OCC. It was a life-changing experience that I'm supremely lucky to have experienced.